Good morning, everybody. Um, still have to give you my thoughts about England's win over um, Colombia on penalties to boot. But yeah, it was a short night and I didn't want to uh, do a video. Yesterday in the evening I will do some on my way to work. But yes, I ran the numbers and let's have a look at them, how the things look after the round of 16. With the quarterfinal set, we have a completely new ranking in a way. For the first time England is in third spot. Um, kind of not so very, very surprising given that they have the easier path. We still have Brazil and France in first place for winning it all and Brazil being uh, quite a substantial favorite, twice as likely as France and more than twice as likely as England, Belgium and Croatia who basically round out the five of the most hopefuls. Uruguay is a little bit buried uh, thanks to the draw where they have to first go through France and then either through Belgium or Brazil and the outsiders of Sweden and Russia. Um, by now you should know the projected three. Uh, we have Uruguay and France, France being favored. We have Brazil and Belgium with Brazil favored. Uh, very similar matchups strength-wise. Then we have again very similar, they're all very similar. Uh, Russia and Croatia and England and Sweden. Uh, and again Croatia is favored and England is favored. Then we have Croatia England semi-final here with England going all the way to the final and a France Brazil semi-final up here. Brazil going to final and of course Brazil to win it. Um, let's also look at the indices because there has also been quite some movement. We have now a new leader in Sweden who takes top spot ahead of Russia uh, mainly due to the draw not because of a rating but the draw uh, winning group F and then avoiding Brazil um, basically is what made Sweden go uh, allowed them to go that far. Um, England rose also quite some, while Belgium, uh, France, those stayed the same. I see here the index is missing, but it's a 0.4 index. Um, the other teams, Switzerland, of course, falling. Brazil, again, rising a little bit. So they're getting slowly better, and Colombia now has a slightly disappointing, but still average performance. Well, let me know what you thought about these ratings, and I will talk to you soon. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and subscribe to my channel. If you've already done so, I would like to thank you for your support. It is very much appreciated. Also, check out the accompanying blog at the link provided in the description below and at the end of this video. Thank you for watching and until next time.